really hazy, guys. I'm sorry. But there's guys who have climbed the top of that hill. To <laughs> that must be the coolest job. Stay Wait, did I, I, don't, I don't know if standing on top of that dirt hill is the coolest job. I think it is. Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome back. We're uh, at the top of the Mickey and Friends parking structure for our Saturday morning, our hazy morning visit this morning. I don't even know what. We're gonna give it a shot. Uh, normally, I these are the kind of conditions where I would say we're not gonna shoot. We'll do it later. But yeah, we'll come back when it's sunny. But it looks good enough. <laughs> Sometimes good enough is good enough. Plus, there's people doing stuff right now. Plus, right there's like, we, well, look, guys, they're they're lifting stuff. <laughs> I've never actually seen them lift anything, oh, except for that one H-pile. They're lifting stuff and moving it. He's gonna put that right over here. I think those are some of the forms. Yeah, finally. The forms that were, no, the forms that are up against the Ford are still there. Those have been there for a couple weeks now. There's just more of them piled up. That's just where you put the forms now. I've got, uh, I've got Ian here with me. Yes. We're, uh, Sarah's waiting for us at the at the hub. She's oh, just, okay. she, just chilling. Just I let her. You know what, Sarah, just sleep in. <laughs> so she's gonna meet us there at the hub. Um, before before we start fighting over uh, the river, because we were just doing that while we oh, weren't yeah. on camera. <laughs> yeah, we gotta keep ABR always be recording. Oh, I know, right? <laughs> um, I want to start with the pool. Wait, let's actually slide over to the left a little bit. It is now a deep end pool. They dug that thing deeper, didn't they? Yes. Now, what I'm being told is that that's just shoring. You know what shoring is? I mean, that it's just so they can, they won't, they have the words, so the dirt doesn't cave in while they do whatever they have to do right. in the hole. Okay, I, I, can, I, can, I can go with that. I get shoring. That's a big thing to shore up. Yeah. Why is it a perfect square? Like, it looks, why, oh, actually, I shouldn't even tell you that. It's not a perfect square. It's a perfect square and a couple rectangles. Like it looks like it's a design. All I know is when I looked at the oh, an over an overhead shot. Yeah. The big big show building. That's not the entire thing, but we'd have to go right. over that. The it's big the, show building has to include that. The, no, right. That's in the footprint of the big show, yeah, but it's not. Be, it's not the show. Yeah, but that still has to be in the footprint of the big show building. Why are they digging it only there and not anywhere else? I don't know. Maybe there's specific wiring or cabling or something or piping that needs to go through there. You heard I, it here I, first. Specific wiring and cabling. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to do that. I know. <laughs> Specific. <laughs> I love this drum so much, you guys. This is the best thing ever. Okay, so, right. So, I okay, Shoring, you don't want the thing to cave in on everybody. I get that. It just seems like it's just that spot. They don't care about anything caving in anywhere else. I mean, well, how can they just dug that one square? I just... Something, I, I gotta make sense of this. You know, hopefully, after two years of doing this, we'll, we'll be like semi pro like, oh, construction. God, why, didn't, we'll be like, why didn't we see it? We're such idiots. Such it was dummies. So obvious. Yeah, such dummies. Yeah. So that, that's what's gonna happen. So that the next time when they build whatever land next, Lord of the Rings land, because you know Disney's gonna buy that eventually. You're kidding? We're gonna walk up to J.R. Tolkien's granddaughter and say, here's a check. I'm pretty sure the current person we would rather die than, than sell it to anyone else. He's still upset that they made movies in the first place. Oh, is he really? Yeah, the current son of her heir. Yeah. Yeah, he's like, no, I never should have given the rights to Warner Brothers. I hate no, it all. Don't be such a toad. I'm like, you guys, that's the best like an adaptation you could have possibly right, gotten, they right? Could, they could not have done better than that. No. Not, not to mention, your dad wrote that kind of on accident. It wasn't, it wasn't like... Well, he wrote Hobbit first, and then went on to do Lord of the Rings. Well, what he was trying to write was a language, and the story came out of it. Yes. Yeah. So, yes. I mean, come on, dude. Yeah, because he's <laughs> it's not like because he's a linguist in his spare time. He just right. invented languages. A lot of people said he's not even a particularly good writer. He has, to, you know what I mean? Like, he, he he doesn't know how to construct a story normally. We're all way off topic. Star yeah. Wars land. Okay, let's get back on topic here. Uh, where was I? Uh, we were looking at the pool. The pool. Okay, so it's deeper. It's yes. way, way deeper. It's a good four feet, five feet deeper than it was. Yeah. Uh, and now, what is that, by the way? Do you see where it looks like they're they're building like a they they, they put something on top of it, like um, like it's a I, den. It's a den for the pool. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I I haven't just the foggiest. Is that like the secret lair? 
Uh, you know, you heard it here first, Fresh Bank. That's a secret lair. Yep, yep. Nailed it. Nailed it. <laughs> hey, Kelly, come back. I'm sorry. <laughs> People are like, why don't you just shut up and show us? <laughs> you don't know what you're talking about anyway, so just shut up. Just stop talking. Oh my god, look, it's muffins. <laughs> so like, they're like, why don't you just stop talking and just show us what they're doing? I'm like, no, this is how we do it. <laughs> this is how we do it. Okay, let's get out of the pool. I want to talk about the far wall. That's the very first wall we ever saw them build. That is true, that it is. Uh, it's still about the same. They haven't really done much to the wall, but it looks like they built a mountain that you have to kind of climb up in order to do whatever it is that they're doing up there on that wall. Can you guys see that? I think you can see that. Let me let me get in a little closer. It's really hazy, guys. I'm sorry, but there's guys who have climbed the top of that hill. To <laughs> that must be the coolest job. Stay Wait, did I, I don't know if standing on top of that dirt hill is the coolest job. I think it is. I'm gonna climb hills for a job. I can't. Okay. So yes, some guys have climbed the top of the hill, and I don't know what they're doing. Why did somebody tell me why that dirt is there? You know why that dirt is there? Uh, no. Because it wasn't always. No, definitely not. And it looks like they put more of it, actually, than there was before. Yeah. I want to know why that dirt's there. Where, where, oh, here's a good question. The train, is it going to be on the other side of that wall? Yes. Yeah. So why, why a big pile of dirt up against it? Yes. Yeah, right? Yeah. Is that just dirt land? Okay, moving on. Aha, this is one of my favorite things right now. This is the only thing that I'm like pretty much sure of, oh, is that tunnel. Yeah, we'll that, walk under the tree. That door. tunnel has just got me so geeked right now because I can, I can see people walking through it and I can see a train going over it. Yeah. Right? Yeah, definitely. Now that does beg the question, Where does the train come from in relation to, you know, these other walls that they're building? Man, what a mess that is. There are four cranes right there in my shot. Wait, yeah. no. Now there are, no. Now there are four cranes in my shot. The cranes are out in force today. It's a bunch of dragons. We're hard. We're like giraffes. They can't really. You like giraffes? I think they look, I mean, they remind me more of a giraffe than a dragon. <laughs> okay. Uh, all right, so yeah, I just I just want to look at the, the tunnel some more because I think it's really cool that we can, you know, the, the, that we can see that. And that's the one thing that we can kind of hang our hat on and say, that's something. We know what that is. And, uh, and you know, it kind of gives you perspective for the rest of the land and how things are coming. Whereas this mess of walls, I have just no idea. Ian, seriously, I have no idea what's happening there. There's like 18 different directions it's pointing. There's these two new walls that have been constructed. The one on the left, the, the shorter concrete wall that looks like actual concrete. And it's got the, some wacky shapes. Right, that's, that looks like a jigsaw puzzle. And then the one on the right that is just formed still. They haven't, you know, they haven't made it permanent yet. Right. Uh, on Wednesday, I was saying the short wall was on the on the island side, and the, and the forms were on the river side, on the Star Wars side. And I've been since corrected vigorously on that <laughs> by literally everyone. <laughs> so okay, if see now from here, when we were looking at this from the from the far side down, way down there. Yes. When we were looking at it from there, I could see it easier. You know, the perspective was easier for me to see. But from here, doesn't that look like you could fit a river in between those two walls? Between, oh, between the jigsaw and the tent one? Between the jigsaw and the form, yeah. Doesn't this look like you could fit something in between, like a fit a river in between there? Yeah. But you're telling me, no, you can fit a river between the jigsaw and the island. And I'm saying, like, that's crazy town. It's the perspective that's throwing you off. Well, I hope so, because, uh, <laughs> That does not look right to me at all. But they're saying, yeah, you could you could actually you know draw a line, you could connect those. What you can do, it's a lot easier to connect the jigsaw with the uh, completed concrete forms on the left. Uh, that's a little easier to connect those. It just seems like such a tight fit to fit not only not only a river, I mean a, a boat, but a train also. <clears throat> Where do you put the train there? 
right? Yeah. Where do you put a train? And a waterfall and a bridge. Yeah, sure, sir, sure, as good as mine at this point. It looks wide when you come out of yeah. the Hungry Bear. That looks wide right there. It is fairly wide coming out. But then that right turn, it's when you start turning right and you gotta get it you gotta get it right in there. Man, oh man. Yeah, oh, it'll get it'll get narrow. Ducks are gonna die. That's all I'm saying. Canoes will be smashed. <laughs> Canoes. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's gonna be blood in the water, you guys. <laughs> Just saying. Just saying. We've got lots more videos for you to see, so grab a churro and check out our Star Wars Land updates from the Knothole Gang, or maybe our Secrets and History videos. Or you can just watch all of our weekly trip reports and have your mind blown by how much fun we're having. We truly are the best of Disney Bake Fresh daily. And don't forget, you can support Fresh Bake by joining our Patreon campaign or by buying a Fresh Bake t-shirt. Thanks again for watching, everybody. Fresh Baked!